Hello, I'm going to show how to use Team Site AI Perception Detection by Affiliation with Blueprint Callable Attitude using C. This is Unreal Engine version 4.23.0. This is the third person C template. I named the program Team 2. I'm using Visual Studio 2017. To create my AI controller 1 and 2, right click, select new class, show all classes, AI, select AI controller, next, enter the name that you want to name the controller and press create class. I'm going to cancel this because I've already created them. For each C++ controller, 1 and 2, you need to create a Blueprints controller. These are the Blueprint controllers that you're going to create, 1 and 2. To do that, highlight each one and right click and select Create Blueprint Class. Give it the name that you want and then for the path, select blueprints and then press create blueprint class. I'm going to cancel this because I already created them. There are six files but I'm only going to show the code for the two character files and the AI controller 1 files because AI controller 2 is identical to AI controller 1 except for the assignment of the team ID. This is my AI controller 1.h. This is my AI controller 1.cpp. This is the assignment of the team ID 1 for controller 1. On my AI controller 2.cpp, the only difference between my AI controller 1.cpp is the assignment of the team ID. This is assigning team ID 2 for the controller 2. On team 2 character.h, this was added, and this was added. And these lines were added. On team 2 character.cpp, this line was added. This assigns a team ID of 0 to the character or the player. These are the lines that were added to make the node callable on blueprints in my AI controller 1.h. This was added blueprintable and these lines were added and on my AI controller 1.cpp these lines were added right click AI one character and edit change AI controller class to AI one controller I've already done that Highlight AI1 controller and edit. Add the AI perception component from this drop down. 
after you add the component, select the AI perception component, and on this side, click the plus for add element and add AI site, site config. And then expand this out. And then under detection by affiliation, check detect enemies, neutrals, and friendlies for the test. We're going to click AI1 controller and edit. Highlight AI perception component and add event on target perception updated. You need to add this blueprint. Get attitude towards is the node that you made callable from the C code. Once that's done, compile and save. On AI2 character, the only change that you're going to make is to change the AI controller class to AI2 controller. On AI2 controller, you don't need to make any changes. You don't need to add the AI perception component here because you're not going to use this bot to perceive anyone. This is AI one character that I placed into the scene. I'm going to press play and test the AI one character perceives the player as hostile. It said hostile. So that's working correctly. I'm going to place bot two in front of bot one. It should detect it as hostile because they're on different teams. I'll press play and it's detecting as hostile so that's working correctly. I'll delete this bot. Now I'm going to place bot1 in front of bot1 and it should detect it as friendly because they're on the same team. Press play to test and it's friendly, so that's working correctly. I'll delete this bot. To test neutral, I'm going to duplicate the third person character. I'll call it AI3 character. And I'll drag in AI3 character and press play. And it says neutral. So that's working correctly. And I'll delete this.